Okay, so you pass your text class, right? Your text prep class, right? So you passed that already. Did you go back and go get that PTC? That P, that P, no, TPR test? Did you pass it yet? Once you pass that, you go to back to the IRS. And then you go get your P, your PTIN number. It's more of like a, like a, like a little bit of license thing. But go get it. So by, I want to say by January, niche like, so well, some, certain tax companies open like January the 3rd. Or the end of December. After Christmas. So you can start filing taxes. But you got to have your PTIN number. If you do not have that. You can't not file taxes for your clients. Uh, yeah, I'm sorry. I forgot to tell you. You got to pay $40. Yeah, you got to pay $40. If it's your first one. It's like $34.35. If it's your second one. You got to re just renew it yearly. That's all you have to do. So, to get your text, let's see. I had it, I had it, I had it. I'm on the computer, y'all, while y'all in the back of it. So, that's what we're doing. To get your TPRT, you have to pass that class. Remember, I told y'all before, you got to pass that with a 70 or higher. It's only five tests. Remember, I told you that. But when you pass that, then you can go back on the IRS and IRS website and grab your PTIN. It's a little license that will carry you. And guess what? You can make your text course into a business mm. very very interesting so once you pass that that exam go get your PTIN if you did not pass it like I said before you gotta go pay for it or if you working for a company they kind of like linger you as some kind of like maybe you need help to pass it but go past that once you pass that you should already pass that already but go get your ptim of course right now this is the holiday season right now so nothing is not really really open but when you do you can go fast start filing taxes i said this already before in my last video I think the one is in two weeks ago. Mm, this one says two weeks. Yeah, like two weeks ago. So when you file that one, so you can go file other people's taxes for them. Most of them start, the business start open up like, yeah, like January, like the beginning of January or the end of December. Since we're in this little COVID little world, dude, you can also file online for them. If you can set it up out of their window, so when you make it into the business, you can tell them to go to their page and give you kind of like a brief how your customer service is, how your performance is, how you greet them. That's if you want to open up maybe next year, you want to just get your foot wet in the door. Mm. So, yes, anything you do, you're making it into the business. It's like almost cutting grass. Now you can make that into business. Lawnmower, edging, weeding. Make it to the business. So we already know we need summer and spring cutting grass. That's making it to the business. So I'm shutting down on winter and I'm back open in the summer. See how that works? Very, very neat. 
So yeah. Yeah. I like that. Oh man, the itches. But yeah. So you can actually get that done. So by Monday or Tuesday, go get your PTIN. You should already have it. I think it takes 24 hours for the IRS to verify your identity. Or you can also call them. It's an 800 number. Um, No, I do not know it offhand. But it's an 800 number. Call them to set that up. We should already pass that test already. This is your girl, Latanya. Talk to y'all later. Congratulations.